You're watching Wolverine TV. Hey, Bronx Science. Welcome back to a new episode of Wolverine TV. I'm Lola. And I'm Taz. Let's kick off this week's episode with Fast Forward with Fahim. Hey, Bronx Science. Welcome to a new episode of Fast Forward with Fahim. Hope you're having a wonderful week of school, but now let's fast forward and see what events are coming up. Schools are closed tomorrow because of the Lunar New Year. Midwinter recess starts on February 15th and ends on February 22nd. That's all for today. Enjoy your break, Bronx Science. I'm excited for break. Me too. Now let's move on to Students React. Hey guys, welcome back to Drama with Mama. You remember that thing we do every now and then? I think it's called Teachers React. Well today, let's turn the tables and see a Students React featuring our teachers high school photos. Let's see it, Bronx Science. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Wait, okay. <laughs> <laughs> It's not that different. I mean, yeah, I was, he just he's, looks he's, like he's a younger smart. version of himself. Yeah, yeah, that's how he it looks like he works. would go to school with us. Are there gonna be puns for all of them? Oh hell yeah! <laughs> that's so cute. My God! Oh my God! <laughs> Is she? She's like a real life princess. Isn't she the one that's saying like that song she wrote? at the faculty talent show like two years ago. I forgot what it was called. But... Wait, what was her song? All I remember is like- Oh, oh, oh. so it. tell me you stand. Oh, I can see <laughs> videos from that. You know what this reminds me? Oh my God. Did you watch <laughs> Saved by the Bell? Like he looked straight out of a 90s hit show. He changed I can see so that. much. The fashion style and the pose, and he was like, I know exactly what I'm in the suburbs. He was living his best life. <laughs> this li this looks like California in the 90s. Like, this is like a typical California 90s break. Yeah, oh my god. Well, I guess they just never age. Until next time, this was Drama with Mama. Those pics are crazy. Yep, now let's move on to current events with Asuka. Hey, Bronx Signs, I'm Asuka. If you need news, I gotcha. This week, we'll be talking about President Biden's executive orders and first actions in office. First, let's discuss his actions for COVID-19. Biden starts off strong with his executive order issued on January 20th, mandating masks and physical distancing on federal property. On the same day, he rejoins the World Health Organization. Then January 21st was a busy day. First, he mandates masks and other measures on domestic and international travel. This order also requires people coming into the U.S. to provide a recent negative COVID-19 test. The next order accelerates development of COVID-19 therapies. Then he puts forth an executive order for a sustainable public health supply chain. Biden also establishes a COVID-19 health equity task force. Finally, he places an executive order on supporting the reopening and continuation of schools with an emphasis on early education. Now let's talk about economic relief. On January 20th, Biden pauses federal student loan payments. He also plans to put out a $1.9 trillion COVID-19 aid package, which is a bill that the House plans to pass. As for climate change, on January 20th, the U.S. rejoined the Paris Climate Agreement, a global pact that plans to reduce carbon emissions. On the same day, Biden places a temporary moratorium on oil and gas activity in the Arctic National Wildlife Refuge. On immigration, Biden gives a proclamation on ending discriminatory bans on entry to the U.S. He continues by preserving DACA, which defers the removal of undocumented immigrants who were brought to the U.S. as children. As we can see, since entering the office, Biden has been extremely busy and let's wish him luck for the next few years. Thanks for watching and back to you guys. Thanks, Asuka, for letting us know about those new policies. Yep, now let's roll some impressions. It's the second week of Black History Month. Now, you may be familiar with the month, but did you know that there has been a yearly theme since its inception? The theme of Black History Month for 2021 is the Black family, representation, identity, and diversity. According to Carter Woodston, the intention has never been to dictate or limit the exploration of the Black experience, but to bring to the public's attention important developments that merit emphasis. Are you a student who is struggling in class? Well, don't worry, NHS Office Hours got your back. 
With remote and blended learning, this school year has been a learning curve for all of us. However, we wanted to let you know that the NHS Tutoring Program is offering remote office hour tutoring services. Students can attend office hours and ask individual NHS members questions about different subjects or topics any period throughout the day. The office hour sessions run on weekdays throughout the entire school day. You can find a Zoom link in the weekly Bronx Science emails. Hope to see you there. Cool. If you have any promos you want us to air, make sure to email them to us at wolverinetv at bxscience.edu. We look forward to seeing them. Make sure to follow us on Instagram for more useful content. That's our from the CFC people. Catch you next time. And, and as always, thanks for watching. watching.